Hey guys, so why is my camera so blurry? Let me clean it, hold on. Okay, so I think it's better now. But anyway, so hey, what you doing? So I'm on like this mission to like update my house. You know, I did the this wall, remember that? This DIY wall. And I was like, oh, well now I wanna go ahead and update these lamps, not lamps, I'm sorry. Ooh, ceiling fans that I've had since we moved in, you know, the old school, the white. Uh, let me show you guys what I'm talking about here. These white ceiling fans that are builder grade that come with your house. Uh, gotta get in the tool. So uh, these fans. Not sure if you're familiar, but we had those fans in every, now they're not, but we had those fans in every single room, right? Uh, including my bedroom, and I was just not, I'm not having it. I had an old school brass, can I find it? Let me see. You see this? This little box thing, old school brass pendant light, which was in my staircase. So I decided I wanted to redo everything, right? So I went on Amazon, and I will put the links to what I bought, and got four fans and a pendant light. I'm like, okay, it's a little pretty penny, you know, but, you know, I it, it'll revamp my house. What I wasn't thinking about, I have to have to install these bad boys. And I can't do it because it's heavy. You know, I can do little light fixtures here and there, which I, I installed, yes. Sherry the Tool Man Smith installed those. Buttons and pendants. That's gonna be, you know, a little bit out of my wheelhouse. So I went ahead and went on Thumbtack and decided to, you know, get some quotes. Uh, why nobody told me that installing a fan is like $150? Keep in mind, I got four. And the pendant light. So, they're already on their way. They shipped. So, I'm like, alright, well, I gotta do it. So, I went ahead and got a guy to come install it. In the process of installing these lights, he blew a fuse. I don't know if he blew the fuse. I don't know if the fan, he claims the fan did it. So, now I have an electrician coming. Yay, repairs. But anyway, let me show you at least the updates. So you go up my stairs. We used to have that brass box. Now we have this fancy uh, modern 3D, it's not 3D, LED is what I was trying to say. I'm gonna show you with the lights off. Uh, pendant light, which still needs adjusting by the way according to the guy that installs it he cannot make it any higher because if my husband goes up too fast he can hit his head on this pendant light and that was not the case before so i will have the electrician somebody that knows what they're doing look at um shortening this because i think all you have to do is pull the cord up into the the base um but once again you need a very tall ladder and not once again out of my wheelhouse then I will take you into the rooms that still currently have no power because the guy blew a fuse. But the fans are up and they are cute. They come with little um, remotes here to turn it off and on and reduce speed. This is Paige's fan. It has like, a, well, they're the same. It has like a wood grain, mm, white, I don't know what that color would be. Finish. Let me show you the guest room. It might be a better better lighting in here and they're LED so you know modern better than those white ones that I had um, and then we also updated in Casey's room this is his new room um, which he actually just got updated yesterday but at, while we're doing it I said he needed a new fan that's what prompted this so this is the fan it's very bright um, he put up his baseball stuff on this wall. This is not going to be his bed. Ignore this. He will have a bunk bed. It's going to be delivered on Saturday. And I'll um, put in a video or something after it's all said and done. Got wrestling. <laughs> got some Gucci bags. Keep in mind, he owns nothing Gucci. But <laughs> got his Gucci bag. His Versace box. Signed Harlem Globetrotter stuff, baseballs from game winning balls. So yeah, his room is, and then the gaming setup is not done yet. We moved it, but it's not complete. He still has to put stuff up. But anyway, the real thing I want to show you, my fan, which is actually the best one yet in my master bed. So 
looks all regular, right? Let's see, can I turn you on? Nope, I need the remote. Ooh, purdy. So I'm like, what is this little fan gonna do? All right, it looks all little. Are you gonna cool me down, fan? So I wasn't, I wasn't confident in this fan, right? Then I turned it on, and my confidence rose. I said, okay, air conditioning. And it's very quiet. It's LED. You can dim it. Yeah, let's see if I can do that for you here. It's daylight outside, so I don't know if you can see that color change. But it changes. And then I can dim it. That's the dimmer. That's the like tone of the light, you know, natural and cool and warm, all that stuff. But it is very fancy and it does definitely cool down the room. Probably better than those white fans did because according to the guy, this is turbo. Um, but yeah, those are my new fans. I'm waiting on the electrician now to see if he can fix whatever went wrong when this guy installed the new fans. You know, what was just my, oh, let's update the fans, turned to, into a $1,500 job. But, I mean, I live here, so you want to make it something that you like, right? So, yeah, we got to get this. And also get the, or fixed, I should say, for the two fans in the guest room and in Paige's room. Because last night she had no power. She wasn't a happy camper. So I ran an extension cord <laughs> into the hallway so she would have her Alexa playing her music. Gotta, gotta have that. And she needed the Alexa for her alarm. And she had her, like, skylight that needed to be lit up or else she could not sleep. And her lamp for the morning when she had to wake up. So I'm waiting for the guy. He is half an hour late, which is not a good sign starting off. Hoping he pulls up soon and we can restore power to these babies' rooms. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think about the fan. I'm going to put the links, um, in the description box and I will try to remember to post Chase's room with the bunk bed and the guest room with the new twin size bed. Bye guys. Like and subscribe. All right, y'all update. I'm in the car. I'm going to get the kids, but the electrician came and they were able to fix, um, the two fans. They got power back in that room which is great. So Paige will have power tonight for all of her um, electronics. Um, it cost me another $200. And according to them, it was way the fan installer did not install it properly. So now I'm contemplating, do I go back to him and say, I need a refund of at least, you know, the cost of another person coming out, $50, $60, something. Because I paid you over almost $600 and I still had to have somebody come behind you to fix it. I don't know. I mean, they, they were a nice couple, it was him and his wife. And, you know, I think it was just a lack of knowledge because my electric, my house has old wiring and he was not an electrician, he was just a handyman. So do I just take that L? Because it was my fault for not ha hiring an electrician in the first place. You know, my mom used to say, or still says, the cheapest can sometimes become the dearest. You know, you try to get a discount and that discount ends up costing you. So I think maybe I'm just going to have to take an L, you know, and eat, eat it. But what I won't be doing is giving him a good review. Because he did ask me for a review. You know, they didn't clean up after themselves, after they removed the fans. And, you know, just left the old fans on the floor. Didn't even option. I know they weren't going to take them. I'm not going to ask them that. But you could at least put them in a box or put them you know, somewhere easily for me to throw them away. But none of that happened. So that's that's where my negative, not to mention, obviously, he didn't fix nothing. But I'm just not going to leave him a review. So I'm not going to be the person that gives you a one star and then I feel bad about it. But, yeah, update. I will still try to get you Chase's room when it's complete. Thanks. So this is Chase's room completed new bed bunk bed oh that was so close cool. take the rest of the night off
Chase, you always got caught, but this is the first time you won. Is it the first time? And his gaming setup. Oh, yeah, yeah. Feels like Oculus mounts. Oh, give me nice. Xbox. Give me level nine. Give speakers. Me oh, my. Turn, turn, turn. My headphones are stuck. Oh, his headphones. systems. And gaming here and Jason Page. Wait, you can buy the cups. And he loves it. 